Is your disinfection protocol efficient? If you want to know how to disinfect a tooth thoroughly, stay with me. I'm Dani Mancuso, specialist endodontist and prosthodontist, and I'm going to show it to you. If you remember that case that I showed you in the previous episode with the large periradicular radiolucency and then the lateral canals and the obturation of that tooth with the healing starting. So to achieve that, my disinfection protocol is, first of all, I use the sodium hypochlorite all the way through when I'm disinfecting the tooth. And then uh, when I go to the last rinse, I go first of all with the EDTA and I leave that for a couple of minutes. That's when I put my notes in, but I always vibrate that with the ultrasound or any special tool like the XP finisher or something like that. Vibrating side of the canal and leave it soaked for a good minute, two minutes, and then put my notes on, then come back, rinse it out and then put the sodium hypochlorite again disinfect sodium hypochlorite we use five point um something and uh it has to be over 3.5 percent to be efficient that's in the literature that you can see the article so uh make sure you use a, a high concentration leave that soak one couple of minutes i i leave a little bit longer and then what you can do and i do and i did in that case as well is you we use the laser now the photodynamic right the laser therapy is very efficient as well. Uh, I must say that I was a bit like um, in doubt about using it. I saw several articles and it's beautiful in the literature, but I was like, oh, I don't know. And it took me some time to go into it. But if you think about uh, why you use the EDTA, everybody tells you that it dissolves inorganic tissue. Can you see that? You see the sodium hypochlorite and the bubble formation that's slightly easier for you to understand. But the EDTA, you don't see anything. And the thing is, the laser, you won't see see it either but the question is do you do you want to achieve close to a hundred percent of success i know that is impossible to have a hundred percent of success but I, I want to achieve the highest number possible and if this is what you want to achieve as well why not to use it so you are not doing any bad in using it in fact you are doing good so start using the photodynamic and you will enjoy that take care and i'll see you next time